Hello everyone and welcome to Albert Park GP. That's right, throwing it in with the wild card action again. <clears throat> Going to the land down under. Going to be running this technical, tricky, um, and fast street circuit. Um, yeah, this one, like I, I was saying it in the Road America, very opposite of Road America in a lot of ways. Not that many corners where you want to, um, you know, go full beans, uh, full balls. Not many, not many corners where you want to do that. Uh, this one's very break heavy, very technical on your breaking points and like setting up for, you know, multiple corners in front of you. And it's going to be a different experience. And again, no heat race, just practice action. This is going to be our first laps racing on this track here in the grand finals. Take things off for the last race. It's going to be pretty crazy. Um, and definitely a little experiment for potential, you know, future projects with this, uh, you know, F1 street circuit here. All right. Uh, so let's go through the lineup. We're going to have uh, Matt on the left, Coop on the right, Camby, Hunter, Armada, Soul, Vulcan, Detail, Roman, Luke, and Slaunch. <clears throat> Nate's going to be coming out soon and again. 13 laps. Uh, this track has three checkpoints, so this one's going to be 40. That extra checkpoint, so it's going to be 40 at the end. Uh, but 13 laps, yet again, 39 on the night. Here we go. Frag out. Race is green. Racing at Albert Park for the first time. See how this track turns out. Guy's doing a pretty great job through the first sector, not going to lie. Wouldn't have been surprised if it was worse. Here's where things will get messy. Honestly, not that bad. Got some close battles, some big drift action up front. Mega dive going on right there. Three wide. Big run for whoever's on the outside right there. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, there's a Joker too. We're coming up to it. Through that second chicane. Here we go. There's the Joker. Anybody go for anything here? On this first lap, it's too tight. It's too tight. Oh! Oh, man. That is brutal. Alright, well that makes sense. Let's take a look at a replay on this one. So, Soul and Vulcan duking it out here. And I think duking it out for their points position too. Um... And uh, let's see what happens here. So yeah, and this is unfortunate. Vulcan does not have Soul cleared here, and goes for the Joker, and Soul just gets absolutely sent into the wall. That was just yeah, not ideal, not ideal. And interesting, uh, Slaunch will, and then Soul just decides to take it afterwards. I get that. That makes sense. Slaunch takes it on purpose. So interesting. Oh, rock contact. Armada going down passes being made and this is interesting again because Slaunch going for that early and again Slaunch and Luke going to be that battle for the top spot and it's looking like they're going to be on different Joker strategies already who's running up front it looks like Coop's going to take him the whole way around it's looking like he will lead the first lap down can be second Hunter uh detail and Luke right now oh look at this what is this run Vulcan with the momentum. Wow. Oh, Armada <laughs> went for a dirt slide job move on Matt right there. Absolutely missed the corner, but just pulled it in front of him and slapped the rock. Interesting strategy out of Armada there. Interesting strats. Let's go through on we're in lap two. Going through the second chicane again. And this track with a lot of history. Many races ran on here in F1. And, uh, you know, trying it out on Halo. And it's getting interesting for the top three spot. These guys are getting close. Camby goes for a Joker. Those three do not. Let's look at the... Oh! Could have been spicy. Multiple Jokers coming out behind. Everybody electing to take it here. What the hell? Soul's just going to finish him out. I get that. What's going on up there? Let's go get a look at this. What is this battle action going on? I think it's probably this. And Coop's still leading him down, by the way. Coop... Still leading him down. It's looking like... Oh, Hunter with a, a big bog. Detail gets the bog too. It's going to get weird. Luke with the momentum. And I'll just got to give some leeway. And it's not going to be there. Uh, fortunately, not too bad of a column cheese for Detail. They're going to keep it close. Luke going for it. Can't find the line. Now Detail back in the battle. But not going to be able to make a pass happen. Luke's going to have this right side. Detail's going to give it up. Set up for the next fight 
Will Luke be able to make a move on Hunter here in this first chicane? Hunter going wide, drifting. But Luke's going to have to go for some type of outside move. Uh, he's just got the nose. He's getting the run at the end of the straightaway. Details coming back into the fight. Roman's not too far off. And it's hard to say what's going on in the back. Oh, there's the run. There's the run. Will this be the pass? There's the bog. And yeah, you're going to see a lot of those on this track. Like I was saying in the, uh, you know, the, the preview track, very tricky with the breaking points. There's a lot of places like what we just saw with Hunter right there on this track. Coop going for the Joker. Oh, shit. <laughs> Coop coming out in front. Luke to the inside. Hunter as well. Coop comes out in third. Second, maybe. Detail's still there. Oh, that's brutal for both of them. That's brutal for both of them. What's going on here? Oh, Solange making moves. All right, Solange getting up the top five, but he's still got a big gap. But Solange with one Joker down. I don't think two. I want to say just one Joker down. Luke with no Jokers, but he's up into the lead now. Luke going to lead this lap down. Coop taking the Joker that lap. And that really worked out for Luke and Hunter. Did not work out very well for Cooper Detail after that rock contact happened. Very close throughout the field, though, which is what I like to see. That's what we should see um, on these tracks with this type of racing. And look at that massive bog. There goes Detail. Going to just have that run to the right. They're getting loose. Coop will have that left, but he is drifting it. Detail's still there. Oh, a little bit of rumble contact. No mega bog coming out yet, so it's still going to be a close battle going into the chicane. That might be the pass. That's going to be the pass. Nice close racing there. Coop falling back to fourth, but still very, very high on the track um, for him at this point in the race. Slaunch electing for it. Second joker. Oh. Nice and clean recovery. Another second joker right there. That's... Armada. Oh, look at that exit with Matt. Oh my God. Matt went too far inside to dodge it. And Armada kind of saved him. This is getting spicy. Souls right there too, trying to set them up. Goes deep to the inside. He's there. Matt maybe could set up a cross over here. Not going to go for it. Stay on the outside. Armada. Probably going to let Soul. Oh, wow. Armada keep it. What? Wow. Credit to Armada on that one. Not having the rumble, but keeping the run. Keeping this battle alive. And this is going to keep Matt in it, too. Three-way battle there. Nice mid-pack action going on here. Let's take a look. So Luke's got the lead. This lead is getting cracked. Look at this. I think Detail and Coop both gaining on Hunter, but they got to make the pass. Detail with the run. Oh, and Hunter just runs him over the rumble right there, but he runs it too aggressively. Oh, my God. Way too tight. Little too much. Driving into each other, I would say, but trying to straighten it out into this long... It's not really a straightaway, but we're going to call it one. DRS zone here. Hunter just going to go for the Joker. Lap complete. Detail going to go by. Where does Hunter come out? Look at that pack right there, too. Oh, man, this is... This is interesting how this is going to work out right now. I think things not looking great for Slaunch because he's... Buried deep in the field. He's got people to pass on track. And there's Luke with plenty of clean air in front and behind. So we'll see how this works out. But Joker's to take, though. Joker's to take. Slaunch, absolutely done with those. So probably hoping for some late Joker strategy. Maybe somebody stays out and could cost uh, some time there. Could help him out for sure. But yeah, Slaunch is in the absolute trenches right now. Mid-pack, lots of aggressive battling going on there. Last race of the night. Everybody trying to get, um, you know, their last few points, especially with all the ties. I like this. Look at this shot. Might have to go take another look at that one, even. The perfect example of the track here and the breaking points and the technicality. Take a look at this. Slaunch chasing down Vulcan, and you can see Vulcan just absolutely, um, you know, misses the breaking point there and eventually hits that bog, and Slaunch just comes in with so much momentum around the outside and maybe completing the pass that's the hard part though it's it's hard to pass like even when you have those runs it is hard to complete passes on these tracks um and very difficult to do but it's going on 
It's continuing. Vulcan not exiting it, but Slaunch, great run in the exit. And he's given enough room, but the way this track works out, Slaunch should have this spot. It, they've battled the entire lap, but the way this works out, he should have this here once we go into this next chicane. The Vulcan going for it, though. But yeah, Slaunch, you see he did a good job letting off, getting that exit momentum. He's got way more exit momentum than everybody here. A couple guys going wide. There is supposed to be an exit rumble there. I wish there was. Budget was running tight. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Uh, I tried. <laughs> Definitely would have been a nice spot to have one. All good. Pretty great mid-pack action going on still. Um, but that front three... Really running away with it. Luke having a really nice gap right here. Almost this entire straight in the first sector on detail. Um, detail running in front of Coop. Not getting uh, too far away from him, but... I mean, to be honest, they're both gapping uh, the rest of the field right now. Is kind of what it looks like. So, they're doing a great job. And Coop is just, like, legitimately still running in a potential podium spot. Slaunch getting involved. A little bit of wall contact with Roman there. Slaunch not wasting any time. He knows it's on the line, and the gap is huge. Look at this. Got the lines hooked up. I love this part of the track, this long, winding straightaway. Seeing how these runs work out. One of my favorite sections. Any of our GPs. Very interesting with this turn and how you set it up for the next chicane and the different options. And you can see Slaunch going for a wide line, but he went too wide and hit the wall. It's definitely something you can do. You can go wide entering and try to get that you know, straight shot through the chicane, definitely something that you can do, but he just went a little too wide. But luckily, he cheesed just enough to where he could stay in front of Roman, but now they're making gains on Hunter. That's going to make things weird. It's going to be a three-way battle. Hunter just trying to hold off. Roman diving deep. He doesn't care. He's trying to get whatever points he can. Oh, Slunch may be a little too deep on the inside. Now they're still going at it. For that spot, Roman a little run on the exit. Slaunch, you could tell, breaking a little later, just trying to get in front of Roman here. Just trying to have that track position is going to work out. Lap complete. Oh, Slaunch with a wide run. Roman sending it in deep to the inside. Loving the battle action that we're getting on this track right now. Look at this. They both have a run. Hunter with a little bit of a bog going into the second chicane. Got to set it up. Got to get that right breaking point. I think Roman's got it really well right here is kind of what it looks like. Yeah, I think Roman's got this hooked up. Oh, well, Slaunch kind of carried his speed a little bit better right there. So, ah, uh, well, Roman's going for a joker. That makes sense. That makes sense. Come out. Pretty rogue joker, too. Um, I'll admit, definitely a, definitely a joker for, uh, you know, keeping with what we're doing with the, the other, the other tracks. Um, in the season, if we race this one in a future series, it'd probably be some pit stop action. And right now, now we're seeing what, um, oh, Coop getting in front of Detail here. Uh, uh maybe some Joker action there. Assuming Detail probably finished out his Jokers. I think Coop still has one more to take. But yeah, they got the solid gap right there. I want to say Detail done. Coop, I'm pretty sure has one more. Um, but I could be wrong. We are 25 checkpoints since so we're over halfway through. And yeah, right now, uh, to be fair, Luke's still with both Jokers to take, um, I believe. But uh, pretty checked out in front right now. That's a pretty big gap on second. Uh, pretty nice gap on third. The top three all very gapped uh, at this point. These guys got away from that. Oh, well, there you go. There's, I think, the first Joker, I want to say. And you can tell. Like, that's, they'll gain. Uh, they're definitely going to gain, but... Uh, Oh, well, there you go. Detail does have another one to take, so he's going to take his last one there, I would I would say. Um, like I said, I think Coop's got another one. Um, but I'm pretty sure he took one earlier, so I think he's just got one more. And you can see, look at how much time Detail lost at the end right there. Like, just so much time. Um, that's kind of how it works. Look at this! Oh, my God. And, like, right here, this is why that top three. This is why that top three is just gapping. Look at this mess. You just do not want to be where these guys are. Look at this battle cheese going down in the mid-pack. Still, this late into the race can be... Uh, oh, wow, contact. Can be uh, Vulcan Soul. Who's behind Can be? In some weird lighting, I can't tell. 
Ah, oh, it's Roman. Yeah, it's always Roman with the lighting because it just makes him look weird. Um, but yeah, like back here, this is just not where you want to be. It's just so congested, and that's going to be the thing with these street tracks. Like I said, race these in the future if we do like qualifying or just like heat races or whatever. Um, definitely going to be very important on these tracks. Not that you can't make up, you know, spots on the track. You definitely can. Um, wow, Roman's really good at getting runs on that last turn. I don't know what he's doing differently, but I've noticed he does that a lot. <coughs> um, he's been getting some insane runs on that that last turn. I feel like he's just getting so much speed in that straightaway. Um, it's one thing I've noticed he's done maybe better than anyone else. Seems to be his better, his best part of the track. I think Luke may be done with Jokers now. Oh, here it is. Here it is. There it is. There's the last one for Coop. And here comes Detail. Let's watch this. Again, you come out of that Joker. It's so slow. Another Joker over there. We'll catch up with that one in a second. But yeah, it looks like Detail's going to have to make the pass happen on track again. For a second. So we'll see if we can do that. Hunter. Camby and Roman. And there's Vulcan and Soul. Vulcan and Soul. Not their greatest race in the night, but hey, that's funnily enough. That's the tie. Look at that run. Soul making it happen. And that might be the spot. He needs to protect that inside. He does. And yeah, that might be it. Because I want to say Vulcan and Soul are competing for that top five spot. And that might be huge. That that might decide it. That might decide it. <laughs> like the straightaway view. Still trying to chase down Coop. And now he's got Slaunch behind him. So this might get spicy. Let's take a look at this. Now it's now it's gotten congested. It's uh Coop detail Slaunch right here. Oh, Slaunch with the run right there, but not able to carry that momentum. Now backing it down. Setting up, trying to build up that speed again again. Something very unique to this track. And we're running out of time. These guys need to make these passes happen. No jokers left for these guys. I don't think any jokers left for Luke either. Um, so, yeah, I don't know if anybody... I honestly don't know if anybody in the field has any jokers left at this point. Different Again, I like seeing it. Different lines coming out. You see Slaunch going for that full speed. But, yeah, you could tell he just does not have it there at the end. And this might be the run. Detail going for the back it down and carry the momentum. And it's going to work out. That's the pass for second. That might be a big pass right there. Um, that might be a big pass right there. As uh, it's going to be hard for, for Cooper Slaunch to get back by. Especially um, because we're going to two to go. So not that much time remaining. And wow, Coop's still running. And look at this. These guys are still duking it out too. Uh, Camby and Hunter. Hunter's trying to hold them off. Roman coming up there too. The, like we're two laps to go in this race. And there's still insane battles going down throughout the pack. Still spots to be decided. And again, we're in a wild moment right here. <laughs> Coop running in podium position with two laps to go. Can he hold on to it? This would probably be the upset of the grand finals if, if Coop could pull off this podium here. That would be that might be the one on the season, honestly. That'd be pretty wild if he could hold on to this. He's got another lap and a half to do so. But he's also got a hungry slaunch behind, but at the same time, um, you know, unless a power outage happened, uh the uh, the freaking grand finals hopes for slaunch probably over at this point. Um, but he can still pick up a podium on this race. And I'm sure he's going to want to do that. Yeah, they're, they're getting that nice run. And there's so many different ways he can run that last chicane. That last chicane, probably, probably the trickiest part on the track. A lot of different ways he could do it. Got to find that right breaking point. Got to find the right way to run it. Carry that momentum. A lot of tricky parts on the track. But white flag over there for Luke. One more time around for the lead. Detail still running second. Coop, Slaunch. Coop got a good cap on Slaunch. Not going to be easy. Hunter still trying to hold him off. Can be now. Maybe going defensive mode on Roman. Soul trying to get involved. Look at this. There could be so many position battles still going down on the last lap of our first Hog exclusive series grand finals. And look at that. Roman has that speed, but he needs to find... The opening to make the pass on Camby. Oh, Roman sending it. It's the last lap. He doesn't care. He's he's just sending it. Why not go for it? I I get it. Um, he's he's not really in in position of of losing where he is in the points. So might as well go for it. It's the last lap of the season. Don't want to leave anything out on the track. 
oh, man, I think Coop's got it. All Coop needs to do is get through this one, uh, this last chicane clean one more time, and I think he's got it. And he does. That looked like a pretty good run. I think Coop's got this one. Coming around the last sector with a pretty aggressive run on the dish. Going to be Luke taking Albert Park here and the grand final on this one. Opix with the <laughs> with the uh, fireworks. Detail coming in, holding on to that second place, and he did it. He's going to hold on to it. Coop taking a podium here. Slaunch fourth. And... Hunter making the top five. Can be Roman Soul. Still sending the fireworks. Oh, I gotta show I gotta show this uh I gotta make sure to show this. Look at the view from over here. I was waiting for this one. Oh <laughs> I had to I had to show that. Get the rest of the finishing results here, but um closing it out. A few drivers coming across the line one more time. Finishing order on Albert Park. Luke, Detail, Coop in that podium spot. Slaunch, Hunter, Camby, Roman, Soul. Here comes Vulcan. Um, then Armada and Matt. So as you could probably expect, there's no way um, that there's like a thousand ties <laughs> after the third race. They're already tied going into it. So let's go through points real quick and see what it looked like um so going through the points real quick on again our first hog exclusive grand final closing it out at albert park gonna be luke with 49 taking the win on this one slaunch with a really good grand finals performance taking second in this one and getting that moto win finally uh 45 points for him on the night uh detail taking third few podiums or a couple podiums there good top fives um, just not enough luck to get that top spot. Going to take 42 points, third place. Roman, uh, with a really good start to the night, that last race. He had speed, but that last race was just not his best. Taking fourth with 37. Soul, that top five, he got it one point over Vulcan. Just one point. He closed it out, 32. Vulcan, six, 31. Hunter, seventh, 30. Uh, Camby, eighth, 29. That's wild. Soul, Vulcan, Hunter, Camby, 32, 31, 30, 29. All one point um, as we go down that order. And then Coop, two points behind Camby. He made up so much with that last podium um, and makes up the spot on Matt and Armada. 27, going to get that ninth place spot. Armada, 10th place. 25, Matt, 11th, 19, running it out on the night. Um, but yeah, pretty, uh, pretty wild grand finals. Unfortunately, we didn't get the, you know, crazy battle for the for the tournament in that last race, but we got some good battling for it in the first two, so it was a pretty pretty solid one. Um, but yeah, that's it, going through the results. Um, pretty crazy night. Definitely uh, some good races, good finishes there. Uh, good battle action. think the Albert Park experiment went well. Um, definitely liked what we saw. I liked, I liked how there was, you know, this race could have been 20 laps long. I like how there was so many freaking close position battles that were, like, still going on. Um, when we, when we crossed the finish line at the end, that was, that was pretty cool to see. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, that's going to close it out. So yeah, it was long season, um, after we pivoted, well, we we're going to run this anyways, but we we're going to run it on Sundays. But after we pivoted to running Firestone Firehog first time, um, on Fridays, pretty crazy, uh, regular season and, um, you know, fitting grand final with some surprises and some crack battles and, um, things like that. So that's what we saw throughout the season. Really good season overall. Oh, and yeah, because the last race, because <laughs> the last race got cheesed. I'll throw it out there. Shout out to um, Detail winning the regular season with 220, Luke taking second with 215, and Slaunch third with 183 uh, for the regular season for this one too. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it uh, for me and for us on the season. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Definitely lots of great moments. Um, definitely a definitely a good season to remember. And uh, yes, yeah, so we're going to go to uh, one more Sunday event. One more Sunday event uh, to close out the year. And that's going to be... Uh, that's going to be roulette night. We're going to see some...